Hi, and welcome to CTEC. I'm Tony Zeal, and in this tutorial, we will show you how to connect our MXS 5.0 next generation battery charger. But before we start, I'd like to say a big thank you for buying CTEC. Okay, so let's see the CTEC MXS 5.0 in action. One thing to remember, don't connect your charger to the power socket just yet. Always connect the charger to your battery first before you switch on the power. For this part of the video, we will be connected to the MXS 5.0 to a regular car battery using the battery's positive and negative terminals. But please remember, when connecting to the vehicle, the earth or ground terminal must be connected to a suitable point on the vehicle bodywork. Now, many vehicles nowadays do have specific charging points. If that's the case with your vehicle, take a look at the vehicle owner's manual. That should show you the correct charging procedure for that particular vehicle. So let's get back to charging this battery. First, connect the clamps to the charger using the Comfort Connect system. Quick and simple. Take the red clamp and clamp it to the red positive terminal of your battery. Next, take the black clamp and clamp it to a suitable earth or ground point on the vehicle body. In this case, we'll use the terminal of the battery. Don't worry if you get this the wrong way around at first. The charger has got inbuilt reverse polarity protection, so your battery and your charger won't get damaged in any way. It's also spark free, so no risk if the lead should accidentally touch together. Okay, now it's time to power up. So plug the power cable into your wall socket, and if your socket's got a switch, switch it on. When the charger's on, the green power LED will light up. You can now set the charger to match your type of battery using the mode button. The first time you switch it on, the charger defaults to the normal mode, indicated by the yellow LED under the car symbol. This is the mode you need for a regular battery like your car battery. Pressing the mode button continuously will cycle through the MXS 5.0's different programs in this order. From normal, press again for normal AGM. This programs for AGM batteries, like the ones fitted in cars with start-stop technology. Press again for normal recond. This is a program that's been specially developed to restore and recondition your battery if it's out of condition, or even if it's dead. If you select the recon, it automatically adds the program towards the end of the main charging process. Next is normal, AGM and recon, which is a combination of all three programs. If we press it again, the next program is small, which is for smaller batteries, like motorcycle batteries for example. Pressing again cycles through small AGM, small recon, and finally, small AGM and recon. One more press brings you back to normal. When you've set the correct mode for your battery, you're ready to go. Just leave your MXS 5.0 plugged in to do its job safely while you go off and do something else. If you need to stop the charging process at any time, no problem. Just switch off the power, move the clamps without damaging the charger or your battery. So using the MXS 5.0 is as simple as that. Thank you for watching. 